Hello folks, I don't know about you, but I'm rather excited. I've never really done one of these sort of semi-unboxing. I mean, I have already slightly started on it. I got a bit excited, but... <laughs> right, let's get that out of the way. Oops. Dan, Dan, Dan. It's got a dress on. Oh, it's even got tags and everything. <laughs> Look at that. That is awesome. It's so cool. So what do we have here, Matt? I hear you say. Well, it's clearly a tribute to um, Eddie Vedder's um, telly. Um, his telly actually is sparkly, but you know. This is something that um, a mate of mine who owns a guitar shop um, has, uh, has put together. Um, this is, you'll see a little pay promotion thing on one of the sides because uh, he did give me a, he gave me a few quid off. Um, so I said I'd plug his shop. And so the link for this, if you want to get one, is, is down below. And basically what he's done is he's taken a Fender Squire Bullet um, guitar, which are, you know, budget guitars. He's basically fitted a P90 in the neck position and this custom scratch plate has been um, made for him. Um, it's been recreated really well. It's um, printed, so this isn't like just drawn on. Do you know what I mean? This is a proper printed scratch plate. It's got a little chip out of the top there like Eddie's. Now, before we um, dive into how it sounds, I'll give you a little review of it, um, just in case you're thinking of buying one. Um, but I must um, caveat this by saying that this is going to be my honest opinion, right? I would always give you my honest opinion, um, even though it's my buddy who's, who's um, selling these. Um, <clears throat> but it's hard to give you an impartial review because I knew I already wanted one, right? Because I wanted to put one on the wall. So um, just bear that in mind, right? Because, um, you know, it's un probably unfair on a guitar that cost as little as this did, frankly. I mean, it's an entry level guitar. It's very difficult for me to say, you know, to start comparing it to some of these. The pickups in my PRS cost more than this, right? So there's the disclaimer, but I will be, I will be very honest. And uh, my honest initial opinion is it looks cool as F, basically. I mean, check it out. This is just clean, right? And bear in mind, I've I think I've just got my amp set to it. It's pretty standard settings. I mean, let me put a bit of um, gain on. Archer, right? Yeah. 
Hey, Sounds great to me. sort of time there. Tastes 
like high gain pedals really well. That's my Friedman. <laughs> enjoyed playing this there's just something cool about having something that looks like one of your you know heroes guitars um that actually does sound and play nice i mean I'm, i haven't bought an entry level guitar for a long time and i'm amazed at how the quality has improved i mean the neck is decent the there's a little bit of dryness on the on the fretboard for sure but i mean you can just use lemon oil to get that nicely done um, and that will sort that in no time, right? The P90 pickup, I think you'll notice, was louder than the bridge. I just haven't had time to screw these down, right? Which will lower the uh, the height of the P90. So again, that can be sorted out. I mean, it stayed in tune. It has some decent sounds on it. The tone control is usable. The volume rolls back all right as well, right? And you, you know, it cleans up a little bit. So. I don't have a bad thing to say about it. In fact, I'm actually, I'm, I'm super surprised actually that um, I like it as much as I do. I mean, I think one thing you'll always get with um, guitars at this level is that the frets, if you run your finger along the frets there, they're not, you know, they haven't been polished down as much, but so what, right? It's still super easy to play. So I hope you enjoyed that one. I think you can probably tell from the smile on my face that I did. Um, so uh, yeah, if you want to find out more about about these bad boys, then go and check out check out the link below. And um, meanwhile, I'm gonna have a little play on this one, and then I'm gonna figure out where I'm gonna hang it up. See you soon. Cheers. Bye bye.